Good morning, everyone. So we're here at the Al Jazeera Dive Diving Centre in Russell Kamer. Off to dive a new wreck for me today. Um, we're going to dive called the Filipino Tug. So I don't know what that's about yet. I'm sure the, the dive goes or the boat driver will fill us in on, on the his history of the wreck. After that, we're going to dive the car wreck, apparently. Again, new wreck for me. Uh, not dive hardly at all off Russell Cayman Coast, just mainly the Dubai coast, as you know. So let's see what today's like. I'm looking forward to it. Weather looks good. It's been rough all week, so it's nice to have the flag not moving at all in the breeze. It was a bit windy when I left Dubai this morning. I was a bit worried, but it's nice and calm over here, here over in, in Russell Cayman. So there's only three of us on the boat, which was great, or three plus a dive guide. Um, so it was really a bit like VIP service. About 30 minutes to get to the dive site. You can see here we're just motoring along, and then in we go. I always like it when we get batfish on the line, but there was other big fish around as well. Um, Viz nice at the surface but as we descended and i think this is around tw a 28 meter site the viz wasn't so brilliant but it, you know it, it's typical you know we're, we're used to that sort of visibility there you can see you've got 28.5 um typical tugboat the propeller was there we could um, easily swim around it all it had turned turtle there were some nudie branks about um, i'm glad faith had yellow fins there are nets on the on the wreck, not too many, and I have reported that back to the Dubai Voluntary Dive Team. Hopefully they'll get round to removing those. Um, but yeah, lots of lots of life and lots of fish on this on this tug. Um, so I, I guess it's not dived so often, it's not dived as much as say the, the Dubai wrecks. It's more difficult to get to. Um, but yeah, I enjoyed swimming around the tug. Um, Barracuda came in. It's nice when you when the barracuda come in. I really like it. A few jellyfish around, and then we've got the the, the Jacks and Trevellis swimming round the wreck. All too early, it was over, and we were doing the safety stop. So we've just heard the um, tug got its name, the Filipino. It's quite a sad story. Apparently, a Filipino diver dived it, went inside, and didn't come out. They did find his equipment, but they didn't find the remains. So quite a sad name. Quite a nice wreck down to about 29 meters. Starts at around 18. Um, lots of life on their barracuda. Um, two fantastic batfish hanging around near the surface. Lots of jacks. So yeah, really quite pleased with that dive. Um, sea's still nice and flat. So we're off to the car wreck now. So the car car wreck's about a 17 kilometer boat ride now so we'll do us our, our service interval on the boat moi moi's giving us chai no, now no. and everyone who knows me knows i love my cup of tea that's faith she's a real water baby she's from <laughs> she's from Porta galera so you know why and alex she's getting used to the viz but she's got a smile on her face so she enjoyed it so we're just coming up to the car wreck which is, I think, is a wreck with some cars around it. But I guess we'll find out at the briefing. Well, we're on to the wreck. There was no current. Um, just like the last time, we had no current. And the visibility was worse. Um, but it was actually um, a real wreck. It was a freighter which had been carrying a cargo of cars which were all around it. They'd obviously come off as it was sinking. Here you can see the holds. But the visibility wasn't great. The GoPro and, and the Paralens show it better than it actually was. But again, still a nice, a nice dive. I've not dived here before, so anywhere new is always, always good. Alex, this is the lady there. She first time she had dived in low vis, um, but she wasn't really put off with it. Here you can see them playing around on the, on the bow. Not as much fish life on on this wreck as as the first one, but we were in for a surprise later as you'll see.
And here it is, a whiptail leopard ray, and he wasn't bothered by us at all. Normally they'll, you'll go to film them and they'll scoot off, they're really fast. But this guy wasn't really bothered. In fact, I think he was going to go and take a nap about now. Um, but yeah, but that was, the whiptail leopard ray was the highlight of the dive. Back on the boat, cup of tea, and back home. Cup of tea, on the way back now. The biz wasn't as good on that dive. Although we did have a really nice uh, whiptail leopard ray, which was made the whole dive worthwhile. Small freighter, um, obviously been carrying some cars. Um, don't know what the circumstances of loss, but um, yeah, nice little dive. Um, no complaints with my first time diving out of Russell Kamer.